In Jurassic World Dominion, dinosaurs live and hunt alongside people in a near dystopian future. But the dinosaurs on screen existed at one point, and some of them were as big, fast, and dangerous as their movie counterparts. Which dinosaur was larger than the T-Rex? And what were these dinos like back in their day? Grab some popcorn and get ready to experience the real-life dinosaurs from Jurassic World Dominion. Slashing in at number four is the Therizinosaur. Nice to meet you, but I won't be shaking your hand. The Therizinosaur's claws were about one meter long, and they were mostly used for self-defense. Scientists originally thought the Therizinosaur used their claws for hunting. It turns out that their small heads and teeth shape most likely mean they were herbivores. I've always felt I was an herbivore trapped in a carnivore's body. Okay, so the Therizinosaur won't eat you. But with those claws, you might still want to avoid this dino. Our number three pick, the Dreadnoughtus, is large and in charge. Picture a dinosaur the length of two telephone poles put end to end and weighing more than a sperm whale. Whoa! The Dreadnoughtus weighed 59 tons and measured 26 meters long. In 2014, paleontologists found a Dreadnoughtus skeleton with over 70% of the bones behind its head. That allowed scientists to accurately calculate its body mass. The dinosaur's name hails from a 20th century battleship and means fear nothing. A dinosaur that big could destroy a whole neighborhood with one swoop of its tail. Let's hope they were friendly giants. Dominating the skies is our number two pick, the Quetzalcoatlus. This might be a good dinosaur to befriend if you're a thrill seeker. You could hop on the back of a Quetzalcoatlus and get a bird's eye view of the situation. Research shows that it flew as high as 4,500 meters. I hope you're not afraid of heights. The Quetzalcoatlus could be your source of transportation. They reach speeds of 129 kilometers per hour and they could fly long enough to cross an ocean. The best part is they wouldn't need to stop and refuel and probably wouldn't have those stale, gross peanuts. Peanuts. Before we get to our top pick, we'd like to give the aquatic Mosasaurus an honorable mention. The Mosasaurus is technically not a dinosaur. It evolved from land-dwelling lizards that adapted to water over tens of millions of years. The Mosasaurus was an early seafood connoisseur that ate fish, sharks, and even other Mosasaurs. This marine reptile would definitely put a damper on your beach day. The Jurassic World franchise has featured mosasaurs before, and they're a fan favorite. On screen, they're shown as being bigger than they would have been in real life. I guess it's true what they say. Camera adds 10 uh, pounds. So how many cameras are actually on you? <laughs> Our number one pick is the magnificent Giganotosaurus. In the film, there's an epic showdown between a Giganotosaurus and the infamous T-Rex. So who would win in the fight? The Giganotosaurus is slightly larger than the Tyrannosaurus, and their serrated teeth suggest they would have sliced through their prey instead of biting them. But the T-Rex had a stronger jaw and a much more powerful bite. The fight is pretty well matched, if you ask me. Fair fight. Come on, guys. I suggest you make friends with the Giganotosaurus because they tend to hunt in packs. And I don't want to find out what it would be like to be this dino's enemy. Let us know in the comments which dinosaur you're most excited to see on the big screen. And if you want to meet a dinosaur-like creature that exists nowadays, check out our video about pangolins. Being incredibly massive and impressive animals is what these dinosaurs did. And that's what makes them crazy creatures. <laughs>